This is breaking news. Right. Good evening, everybody. My name is uh, Assistant Chief James McCarthy, Commanding Officer of Patrol Bro Manhattan South. With me tonight, I have uh, Deputy Chief John Shell from Patrol Services Bureau, Deputy Chief Brian Hennessy from the Detective Borough of Manhattan South, Deputy Chief John Hart from the Intelligence Division, and Inspector John O'Connell from the Midtown North Precinct. The information that I'm about to provide you is preliminary because the incident just happened a few hours ago that we got it. Earlier this afternoon at approximately 1.20, a female employee who was working at a nearby hotel began to feel nauseous and was removed by EMS to a local hospital. Well, at the hospital, the female worker advised uh, that she felt sick shortly after cleaning a room, um, and she had cleaned this white powdery substance in the room. FDNY responded to the hotel and began to check that room to try to determine what the white powdery substance was. Since the substance, substance had been cleaned and was no longer visible in the bathroom, the fire department swabbed various surfaces of the room, which initially indicated that it was, there was a possible trace of amount of explosive substance. Midtown North Precinct responded and uh, cleared the 11th floor, and NYPD investigators entered the room and tested multiple surfaces. All subsequent tests of the surfaces were met with negative results. There was no trace amounts of hazardous materials detected. At this time, we feel that the earlier tests, test results were a false positive. A further investigation revealed that a male entered the hotel and gained unauthorized access to the room in question. We have conducted a thorough canvas of the hotel and identified this male through video canvas. He has not been located and our officers are actively searching for him. All guests have uh, been allowed back into the rooms at this time, and operation of the hotel is back to normal. I want to stress to all New Yorkers and visitors that there's no credible threat against the city at this time. It was out of an abundance of caution that we cleared the floor of the hotel while investigating the scene, and all tests were negative. At this time, I'll take some questions. Uh, Tim, I believe and he got in at 10, the room was a vacant room at this time. The people who were in there, the family that were in there, checked out at 10.30 on Sunday morning. At uh, 8.20, it shows a swipe of the room where he entered the room. Uh, the family had five keys, and uh, they believed one of them they must have dropped, and he picked it up. Do you know how long he was in there? Did he have a whole time when left? He got in there at 8.30, he left at 10.30 in the morning video showing him leaving the hotel. Is he known to police? Uh, yes, he is a pers uh, person of interest at this time that's been arrested 16 times for all low-level uh, crimes. Has he trespassed in other hotels? Yes. Does that like the memo? Yes. So, have you uh, made contact with previous occupants Yes, we have, Joe. So how did this woman get sick? I'm sorry, Julie? How, how did this woman get sick? Uh, we don't know at this time. Uh, she just felt nauseous and, uh, you know, and dizzy, you know, after leaving the room. So at this time, we really don't know what caused that to happen. We don't. We don't know at this time because it was like she had cleaned the whole room. So we really don't have. We've swabbed everything, and it's all come back negative. But we don't have the substance itself. When she first started to feel sick, where did she come into contact with the substance? In the bathroom on the sink, uh, surface of the sink. There was just traces of it. Was it powder or liquid? Powder. All right, guys, we're going to move in. Load him. The uh, family was already checked out by the time he got in there. Yes, by the time he got in there, you're talking about four hours later, he got in after the family had checked out. All right, guys, do you have any more of those? How we got long time for one or room? two more. Terry? How long was she in the room? From 8.30 at night till 10.30 in the morning. Can you tell us who this gentleman is? Uh, not at this time, Tim. We're still working on, lo on locating him. Uh, if we don't have them by tomorrow, I'm, I'm sure we'll reach out to DCPI and last get the public right help. Here. Did the hotel indicate if there was some kind of security breach on their end or the card should have been deactivated or anything like that? Uh, they're still working on that because uh, as far as we know, it should have been deactivated after the family checked out. So they're 
They're still working on why it wasn't. All right. Thank you, everyone, for your time and attention. Thank you. Thank you.